We've had some excellent and engaging discussions on the topic of diversity so far at CYBOS. And actually, when you look across the conference as a whole, more than a quarter of the senior thought leaders that are present on panels this year are women, which certainly shows improvement in representation of women across the industry. This week, I'm really looking forward to a session on the future of work, which is all about the war on talent that's happening right now in financial services and technology. And actually, one of the ways in which we can help to solve that challenge is by focusing on diversity, because we simply cannot afford to ignore the best and the broadest talent pools that are out there on the market if we're going to help the industry to continue to grow. On Monday, I was fortunate to be on a panel with Professor Ray Cooper from the University of Sydney, who shared with us her research insights into younger girls' career aspirations even before they enter the workplace. And that was part of a very lively podcast discussion, which also focused on the barriers that women in the industry are facing today, and obviously ways in which we can accelerate change. Lots of different examples came up there, but one that I'm particularly interested in focusing on is how we can tap into that returnee talent pool of women who may have taken time out of their careers and who can reconnect with the industry and come back in the second phase of their career. And of course Cybos is partly about the conference but it's also very much about the networking aspect. And tomorrow evening we really look forward to the first Women of the World networking evening at Cybos. And there I'm delighted to be able to announce some new research call for proposals from the Swift Institute who are going to be asking academia to come up with ways of, to attract the best and the brightest women into the future of financial services. That research will happen during the course of 2019 and the results will be shared with us at Cybos London this time next year. So definitely watch this space. And so far I've been asked a couple of times already if I'm positive about the future of diversity in the industry. And as the mother of three young daughters, I have to say yes, of course. But what we've really seen throughout the course of the week so far is that we're in an industry that's transforming. This is a strong opportunity to make diversity part of that transformation too. I'm sure we're still going to have some great discussion ahead of us, so enjoy the rest of the Cybos week.